One, two, three, all eyes on me is about a crisis that hits an elementary school and it's all told from the teacher's perspective. When Derek and I were writing this script, we knew there was gonna be two big challenges. One, how are we ever gonna get a location to agree to let this film this there? And two, how are we ever gonna get parents and enough kids to agree to participate in this because it is such a heart-wrenching, difficult subject. I talked to the kids pretty extensively. You know, what is it like training for this, drilling for this? What does it feel like? What are the other kids like? What is the teacher like? What are you thinking? Just pretend. Shh. I remember Olivia saying, we do this so frequently that none of the kids really take it seriously. And so they'll start giggling and laughing and our teacher will give us lollipops to help keep us quiet. Does anyone need a lollipop? And that moment made its way into the film. <laughs> There's actually no violence depicted in the film. You don't see anybody get hurt. There's no blood. Just look at me, don't, do not look around. It would be very irresponsible of us to make an anti-gun violence film and then expose kids to violence. All the stuff with the guys on the campus that was filmed on day four, when none of the kids were there, they didn't see them, they didn't hear anything. And then all the gunshots that you're hearing, it's all sound design. None of the kids heard anything like that. Sadly, in our world today, 100% of the kids had been through active shooter drills in their own schools. When I was in school, we had earthquake drills, we had fire drills. We weren't training for an active shooter. A lot of us as adults, we don't fully understand. So I think it's extremely important that people watch this so they can feel what it's like without having to actually be in the situation and they can take everything that they've felt and then push for actual real world change. Stay with me, okay? Eyes on me. Eyes on me. Just me.